Mr. Day, if I see you outside of class again, you're out of here. I... Give me a second, I, I need to get my story straight. My friends are in the back room getting hired to work at the Empire State. Lover, she is waiting for me just across the bar, and I... She's been taken by sunglasses. <laughs> 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 Hello, my name is Angel, and I'm here today to talk to you about a serious matter today, about no more, not here. It's come to my attention that most students don't know what this means. I'm not going to say any names, um, but someone thought this was for COVID. To stay away, don't high five me. But it's not. It's about... Racism. Don't do it. It's not worth your time. It's not worth your time. Racism. If you hear it or see it, speak up. Tell Greg. Tell Brock. Tell Jamie. Tell Thurgood. Tell Wendy or Joe or a trusted loved one. But you know, racism doesn't stop there. It's all around us. It's everywhere. Racism. No more. Not here. All right, so John and I, come over here. Okay. So John and I are the advisors of the school's Multicultural Student Advisory Committee. So the Multicultural um, organization or we're calling it summit it's all about everybody getting along with everybody which is a good thing regardless but we want to have all year long we'll be having different activities in which you will have the opportunity to interact with students of any race any gender any sexual preference it doesn't matter we're all to get in this together we want everybody to get along and this organization is going to help us to do that with an activity at least once a month and the classes will, for the people who are in that will be held every Friday. So come and join us, please. We are having lunch in the Commons next Wednesday, February 16th. And we're going to be having pizza with a purpose. And what that is all about is learning more about Black History Month, looking at the past, considering where we are in the present, and examining how we can have a better, a better future altogether. And um, I want to introduce one of our leaders of this group. Okay, this is Alita, and Alita is our vice president. Turn it up here, darling. So, I want to ask you a question. So, Alita, can you tell us why this organization is important to you? Why are you involved? Um, I'm involved for the message that it gives. Um, it really brings uh, like everyone together. And um, I'm here to act as a voice for all of you. And, um, yeah, I just really love this, um, this group that I'm a part of. And... I'm super excited. So you'll be hearing more about the summit, more about our Multicultural Student Advisory Committee and how you can get involved. So stay tuned for more. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. I wish there was a way we could Yes? No, never mind. Maybe we could. Yes? I'm so glad there's a way we can earn an, an eighth of an elective credit by checking out any book in the library and writing an essay for Cheryl today. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Free books. Free cupcakes. <laughs> Today, Friday, February 11th, is Love the Library, and all books in the library count for an advisory credit. As long as you just like read the book and write a short essay, you take your essay to Cheryl and you'll get an eighth of a credit. Um, there'll be free books and cupcakes and activities. So come get books and get credit. Yay! <laughs> so the basis of this assignment is we've been talking about arthropods and so they have to dis they have to design an arthropod of whatever they want so it could be like an insect or a crab or a spider or whatever 
and then they're making it out of clay and then they're going to paint it and then they have like a little write-up that they do that tells us about it like why they put it in that group why they gave it those characteristics and they're doing that instead of a test is this for zoology mm -hmm. yeah me too i did this <laughs> i took zoology last year and i made a squid out of clay oh awesome that's pretty fun that's great all right that's good okay here we have the yoga class connecting their souls and bodies to the earth <laughs> 